Tillage has been an important part of crop farming since the plow was first invented. An increasing number of farmers are paying close attention to the impact tillage has on soil health and productivity. At a recent conservation tillage conference, hundreds of farmers gathered to learn more about tillage practices and cover crop use. Brian Bigler farms near Lake Wilson, Minnesota, and he has used strip till, no till, and cover crops for the past eight years. I'm just looking out for sustainability. I want to have a farm there in the soil if my kids want to come back and farm. And it's just for all of us, we got to, with the regulations coming about and possibly coming, um, want to do everything we can to keep our soils and just have a healthy soil and not being, having soil erode off and getting our lakes and rivers and everything dirty. Bigler says it can be a challenge for farmers to switch from conventional practices to reduced or no-till, but his results speak for themselves. About eight years ago I started doing this and I've been seeing some really good results with it. I've eliminated, haven't completely, but definitely eliminated a lot of my erosions that I've been having. Um, soil structures built up a lot now. Um, last few years we've been having some really wet falls um, with harvest and a lot of neighbors are getting stuck and pulling combines out and stuff and so far I haven't had any issues with it. I've been able just to sail right on through everything and don't even leave hardly a track out in the field. And my yields are holding up if not running higher than the neighbors have been. Minnesota Corn Growers Research Director Paul Mainz says farmers are learning that reduced tillage often has a positive effect on soil health and productivity. It's also another step that supports farm sustainability. When, many years ago, we, we thought that tillage was the only way that we could really successfully produce crops in Minnesota. And what we're learning as the science continues to grow is that there are other options. And so what we're learning here is both by science and by farmers practicing other things farmers can use on their farm that cuts their, their economics, that helps improve their sustainability as well as their yield production. This is Lynn Kettleson reporting.